This is George Rodriguez with Book Leverage TV, helping you discover the best nonfiction books to achieve peak performance in business, management, and professional development. Today's episode of Three Big Ideas, we'll be looking at Hooked by Nir Eyal, How to Build Habit-Forming Products. Nir Eyal builds, studies, and writes about products and ideas that move people. You can learn more about him at www. Dot near and far dot com. That's N I R and far dot com. So the three big ideas are sometimes better isn't better, vitamin or painkiller, progress principle. Sometimes better isn't better refers to the fact that anyone reading this book wants to build a habit forming product. And the reason you want to build that is because if you just build a better product, something that's marginally better than the competition, you're probably not going to get their customers to come on over to your product. Because the reality is that if we're used to a certain product and we've invested time in a different product, your product's going to be, have to be that much better for us to change. And that's why you want to build a habit-forming product. Second big idea is vitamin or painkiller. In Silicon Valley, when an investor goes to a founder, they'll ask them, what kind of company do you have? A vitamin or a painkiller? If you're a vitamin, you're building a company that people may like, may help, may improve their life. Kind of like vitamins. Now, if you're building a painkiller company, you're taking pain away from people. You're really helping them. These are the kind of companies, these are the kind of products that you want to build because that's helping people. The third big idea is the progress principle, which is short for the endowed progress effect. There was a study done once with free car washes. And if you punched eight squares, so if you paid for eight car washes, you got a free car wash. But the study participants were given two types of cards. One had eight squares. You had to punch each one, get eight different car washes. You got a free car wash. The other half of the participants got a 10 square card with the first two squares punched already. Because those first two were punched already, they had an 82% higher completion rate than the other group that only had the eight squares to begin with. I thought that was an amazing principle and kind of some insight into human nature. Three more books that you might be interested in, if you're interested in Hooked, are Influence by Robert Caldini, Social Physics by Alex Pentland, and The Anatomy of Buzz by Emmanuel Rosen. Hooked is a great manual for building habit-forming products. I highly recommend it, and you should check it out. This is George Rodriguez with Book Leverage TV. If you want to discover the best nonfiction books to achieve peak performance, business management, and professional development, head on over to bookleverageblog.com. Have a great day.